Hi there, guys and girls, my dear friends and subscribers, that's Mechanical Brain Online again, and today in this video I will show you how to make honeybee weave. So that's honeybee weave in my hands, it's nice, bright and shiny, and today I will show you how it's made. Let's start. Well, to make this weave we will need some rings. I will use uh, rings made of stainless steel. The wire diameter is uh, 1.2 millimeters and the inner diameter of the rings is 6.3 millimeters. The mandrel was 6 millimeters. Well, that makes a R slightly more than 5 and 5 is uh, the best AR for the honeybee weave. So, let's start. As you can see, the honeybee chain consists of separate units. So, in the beginning I will show you how to make a unit for honeybee chain. So, for each unit we will need four open rings and two closed rings. Here they are. Let's take let's take one closed ring. Oh no, no, no. Let's take two of them. Two closed rings. Let's take an open ring and let's put these two rings on the open ring. Now let's close the ring. Ok, ring is closed, nice and clean. Now let's take another open ring and let's put it here through these two closed rings. Like that. Now let's close this ring too. Simple at the moment, isn't it? Ok, that's it. Now we got four rings connected and two more to go. So let me show you where will be placed the, the next ring. The next ring will go through this ring here. Here. And after that it will go through this ring. Here. Let's put it in. So, here and here, like that. Now let's close the ring. Okay, the ring is closed. And we got the last open ring. So, where to put it? That's the question. Let's turn our basic element like that. Oh. Okay, that's the ring that we added at the last step. So our next ring will go through these two rings, this ring, this one and this one. It will go here, here, and after that here.
Okay, let's close it. Okay, the ring is closed. And here it is. That's the basic element of honeybee chain. So, to proceed with the chain, we need to make some more elements. I will make... Hmm, I think I will make two more, for example. Well, now I will show you how to connect these element elements to each other. Oh, wait a sec. My cat is so, so, so cute. I must show him to you. Where is it? Where is he? Op, 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 op. Mm. He is so cute. <laughs> well, okay, let's go. Oh. Okay, let's proceed with our weaving, with our B chain. Uh. All right, where were we? So, now I, I will show you how to connect all these uh, elements to each other to get a chain. So, let's take one. Here are two last rings that we have added, I think, yes. They are parallel and identical. Let's take open ring and put it through these two rings here. Like that. Now, let's take another basic element. Here are the parallel rings. We should put these two rings on this open ring. But, uh, but, but... You got to check the position of these two rings so these two rings this one and this one at each element these ring these rings should be positioned the same way not right and this is right way okay so now let's close the ring so now it's quite flimsy so let's add let's double this ring this one, this ring should be doubled, this one. So, where is my open ring? Here it is. Let's put it here. Mm -hmm. And... here. Now let's close it. Okay, now I will add another element and you just watch and repeat if you want. 
of course you won't, I know it. So here is the element to open rings. Let's decide where to put open ring. It will go through these two rings here. Let's close it. Okay, as you can see, our two elements are connected between each other, and we have one element, one unit remaining, remaining, and two open rings. So let's connect it. So, as you can see, the position of the central rings on each unit is the same and it should be at the third unit the same as at these two units so and uh, our connecting rings will go through these two rings you can see where the piece of wire is going through here so like that now let's take an element let's place these two rings in appropriate position no it's not right and now now yes it's right you see these two rings and these two rings are placed the same way so our ring will go here through these two rings Let's close the ring. Okay, now just let's double this ring. It's easy. Everybody can do it. Even a child, of course, with the bigger rings. Okay. Let's close the ring. Well, we did it. We just connected all three units. And so, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you are not subscribed, then you can do it. You won't be disappointed, that's for sure. And, of course, have a nice day, guys and girls. Have a nice day. Bye-bye.